Hey smileys, hey! It's AI and this is AI Brown Smile. Welcome back to my channel for another video. This time I'm sharing a lip care routine that transforms dry lips into lips that are moisture drenched. So stay tuned. Here's a product preview of what I'll use in my lip care routine. This is an all natural lip treatment set by Noog, but you'll also see me use a few more products that are not pictured here. First I use Mary Kay Micellar Water to remove any lip color or gloss. I didn't have to work very hard because my lips were bare to begin with in this video. However, with this gentle yet effective formula, no excessive wiping is ever needed. Next, let's move into a lip scrub. This set includes a lip smoother, which exfoliates and smooths the lips by removing dead skin cells, which helps prep the lips for lip balm. This one is made with cocoa butter, jojoba, and sugar. Both steps are important, especially for people who wear a lot of liquid or matte lipsticks, which can dry out the lips. I'm using a double-sided silicone exfoliating lip brush to gently apply the scrub using small circular motions with the thin bristle side for about 20 to 30 seconds. Be gentle and careful not to over exfoliate. Always apply a lip conditioner or balm afterwards to moisturize and rehydrate the lips. This one is made with coconut oil, shea butter, and licorice root making it ultra hydrating and nourishing. I'm using the opposite side of the brush now which has larger round bristles. Don't forget the lip line and outer part of the mouth as well. Lip massages increase the blood flow to your lips. This step should be at least 20 to 30 seconds as well. However, a basic lip care routine could end here. You could, let's say, leave the balm on for 20 minutes and then remove it with a damp cloth or wear it overnight. Biocellulose lip mask, sure, why not? These masks are especially designed for the lips. They are covered in a serum that easily absorbs into the skin. I keep these in the fridge until I'm ready to use it because the experience is just better that way. The application is easy. Lay the mask across your lips and gently smooth it out for a better fit. And I like that they're made in the shape of an actual lip. I think that's cute. Wear the mask for 15, 20 minutes and slowly remove it. I follow that up with a vitamin E lip mask. Vitamin E is good for the lips because it boosts circulation and it also may help generate new skin cells, making the lips softer. So skincare applies to any area of your face and body that's covered in skin, including the lips. Incorporate a lip routine into your skincare routine today, smileys. Okay, do we wanna go the extra mile? Of course we do. So apply an overnight lip mask. It's a leave-on lip mask that works all night long for smoother, more supple lips in the morning. This one is by Laneige, and it's definitely one of my favorites. Just apply an even layer before bedtime, and boom, wake up with soft, kissable lips every single time. And the final results. Thanks for watching, smileys. Be sure to subscribe if you like good vibes. See you in the next one.